welcome back it's nice to see you again so soon i'm full of inspiration tonight and i got all the time in the world so i decided to be nosy again and i was going over my social media and i'm seeing lots of articles covering kim kardashian and her possible next lover which is pete davidson so i am curious to see what is going on with her life and if this is something that can be uh that is true right so i went ahead and pulled out more cards for her than codex because with her i had more um opposing cards um so kind of like i was like i need clarifying messages i need clarifiers so yeah it's gonna be a lengthy one hopefully not so long so I asked what is her essence, what is her personality like, what is she about, and I pulled um, from my Voyager Tarot for that, and the first one I pulled was Disappointment. When I looked into it, it talks about um, someone who focuses on expectations that are not being met. This let me know, lets me know that she's someone who is hard on herself, who wants to be, strives for perfection, and can be her biggest critic, critic, or critic, yeah. Um, there could be that she feels disappointed in herself, or disappointed in general, because of her focus of, um, of standards that are not being met. She's someone who is very logical and can think logically. That's why she's able to uh, make decisions, aspire to be a lawyer, uh, run a business because she's very, knows how to think practically and has good judgment. Um, so a lot of brain power for sure. But, so, she also expresses this other side, um, which she got the same one as Kodak, as um, Surfer. And if you saw that video, you know that it's someone who is seeking thrill, um, is seeking danger, or like new experiences. It's that risk taker. So, she has this like, um, let's get to business energy, but then she can switch it up to oh, let's go ahead and have fun. You know, I want to feel alive. I have all this passion in me that I offer, that I ex um, exude. Like, this is why she's, like, known to be beautiful, known to, you know, just kill the game of, you know, aesthetics because um, she's able to be creative and passionate and just thrill-seeking, um, free in some moments, right? So I pulled Two of Worlds, which kind of um, confirms that she is this dual, you know, like I'm logical, I'm down to earth, but I'm also um, someone who appreciates adventure, appreciates play, um, who is emotional and passionate as well. So like she's, she has these two th ways and she is a Libra, so she has a Libra scale right so she's always weighing things out uh, so that is the essence of her personality someone who can be cool calm and collected but also the other side of let's have fun let's go out let's you know let's let me feel free um so i pulled some cards out for her situation and i got the reversed world which to me it seems like because of her divorce um and all these in the way it has pro affected her mentality she kind of feels like her world became upside down ever since you know <clears throat> the divorce so she has felt pain over it um interestingly enough i pulled the king of 
um, the Queen of Wands and the King of Wands together. So there's definitely a partner here at play, but they're upside down. So I'm thinking like, is this, can this be Kanye and her and the, their divorce? Or can they, this be a potential lover, you know? But what I am pulling out is like betrayal, um, depression, and just like hard, gloomy times. The world is upside down. There is the king and the queen. A fallen of empire, maybe? Like, this is Kanye and huh? her? There is this. <laughs> it seems like she is bored with offerings. Like, people are coming at her left and right. And they're offering her something. And she's just unsatisfied. She doesn't want to settle. She, she's, you know, she's big in the game. So, obviously, there's going to be people wanting to, you know, get at her. And, like, offer her this this cup but she has her eyes set on something something that she feels like she doesn't have so um if anything let's see one more what do we want to ask um what is it that she wants more than anything what is it that she wants if she's just pondering like you know what is she sad, disappointed about, I guess? King of Pentacles. There's a king. This is like, you know, the go-getter, the money-making card. Um, it can be a person, a person who's very powerful. Can this be Kanye? Girl, you still hurting over him? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. probably so the advice cards that I got from the shamanic deck which is this one so these were my writer weight deck the ones I pulled it says um, it's basically telling her that she needs protection to like protect herself from negativity um, to What's it called? So just like, um, just be careful and just be cautious about her movements and just to be calculated about the way she does her things. But at the same time, so it's protection, right? Protection about, I don't know, she needs to be protected. But at the same time, it's saying to immerse herself. It says sea creature, which is called immersion, to immerse herself um, into whatever she enjoys, hobbies, businesses, ideas, to go ahead and um, immerse herself without thinking twice and just like taking risks and going all out instead of like hesitating and doubting and you know being in that energy. It's also urging her to play, to play like a trickster, um, to take risks again, to um, take time for herself and relax and just like accept challenges and to accept that not everything is going to come out her way right so yeah pretty much I thought it was going to be really really long but it isn't so do we want to ask about Pete Davidson because I don't I'm very confused I feel like those cards were about her um, a strange husband because they're not divorced yet so Okay, does Kim, Light, and Pete Davidson, are they together? Are they together or are they not together? Hmm? Oh, just one card. Just one card to fall, please. Just one card. Oof. Oof. You see, like, it seems like she has options. She has options like there is just more than one person and she really is contemplating like i don't think she is fully committing herself to anyone like there is this balancing of even probably focusing on her money and, and not much of her love life and 
if anything like there's two people on her mind right so there goes your answer